Well, here's a look at what's headed our way. Snowflakes flying in the Twin Cities tonight. This is a live look at a bridge over the Mississippi River in downtown Minneapolis tonight. Uh, do I see snow there, Albert, or no? I saw a couple of flakes. A couple of flakes? Yeah. Maybe the bridge it looks snow covered. Is that worth something? <laughs> sure. <laughs> so this is going to happen for sure tomorrow, huh? Yeah, so we're going to have scattered snow showers much of tomorrow. It's tomorrow evening, unfortunately, as we head into trick or treat time that we could have some heavier bursts of snow, wind driven snow and accumulation. A couple of inches will be possible in northwest Indiana. So here's the latest timeline for you with the snow on your Tuesday, 7 a.m. to 6 p.m. Scattered areas of snow showers. I think we'll start to see the snow move into Chicago by 9 a.m. And then as we head towards the evening time, 6 o'clock to 11 p.m. tomorrow evening. That's when we have that chance of snow squalls or wind driven snow and heavier bursts enhanced by Lake Michigan. And our two main concerns for tomorrow is going to be slick roads and reduced visibility. There could be a few slick spots tomorrow morning, especially on elevated surfaces, bridges and overpasses. Reduced visibility and additional slick roads are in the forecast tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening. So most of Chicago, most of the western or far western suburbs a dusting to maybe a half inch. No big deal. And a lot of that falls on grassy areas. There's a chance of up to an inch of snowfall up here in the northwest suburbs, but it'll be here in northwest Indiana, especially tomorrow evening and tomorrow night that could pick up one, two, three inches of snow, and that's because of lake enhancement winds coming off of Lake Michigan that could allow for some higher totals, but mainly here in places like Lake and Porter, LaPorte County. Tonight, though, with a clear sky, it gets cold as chilly as 23, Aurora 29 at the loop, Valparaiso tonight at 26, and stuck in the mid to upper 30s for tomorrow, 38 at O'Hare for the high, but you factor in these strong winds out of the west northwest it'll feel like the 20s all day tomorrow with the wind chill and for the trick-or-treaters snow showers are in the forecast some of which could be on the heavier side especially in cook county to page county into northwest indiana and it'll feel like the low to mid 20s area wide tomorrow evening for trick or treaters. So let's take you hour by hour between seven and nine. Watch the first band of snow come in out of the west. A lot of accumulation possible there. And then it's just little waves of scattered snow showers in the afternoon. So through six o'clock scattered snow showers. And then as we head into the evening, there's 7 p.m. Notice the heavier bounce of snow coming off enhanced by the lake. Cook County, DuPage County, even portions of Will County into northwest Indiana. By late tomorrow evening, those snow bands enhanced by the lake begin to shift here in northwest Indiana. And that continues tomorrow night and also into the pre dawn hours of your Wednesday. So overall, best chance of one, two, three inches of snow. It's going to be in northwest Indiana. For most of Chicago, we're anywhere from a dusting to a half inch, but it's going to be not a great evening for a lot of trick or treaters. Now, if you're out towards the west tomorrow evening, DeKalb, even Aurora, I think you're in good shape. This is going to be mainly for areas near the lake tomorrow evening. Hey, we're done with the snow and done with the 30s. On Wednesday, 42, 50s are back. We like that Thursday, Friday. How about near 60? How about that? With a slight chance of rain on Saturday. Here's a heads up. We fall back this weekend. Time change. Oh, that's right. Saturday night at 2 a.m. Mm -hmm. Well, Sunday morning. An extra hour of sleep for everyone. There you yeah. go.